Fulfilling a Dream, a story so powerful an Oscar-nominated filmmaker signed on to tell it. And it all started in the Susquehanna Valley with a Carlisle man just trying to find a car. Here's News 8's Cumberland County reporter Matt Marcaro. For one night only, the bulbs will be bright, the red carpet unrolled for a world premiere movie about a car at the Carlisle Theater. And I immediately, the wheels started turning. I said, this, this is an amazing story. And Oscar-nominated filmmaker Michael Brown just happened to stumble upon it. For several years, I've been trying to find a way to combine what I do, which is produce video, with what I'd rather do, and that's fool with Corvettes and classic cars. So the, the perfect combination came when I met Lance. Lance Miller is the co-owner of Carlisle Events, which puts on the car shows. And this car, the number three Cunningham Corvette, was his father, Chip's dream, to find the car and give it a victory lap at the famed Le Mans track in France. Chip died before he could achieve the last step. I had a very strong bond with my father. He was my mentor, my absolute best friend, just all-around great guy and an incredible father. Um, I just felt the need of you know, fulfilling his dream. And at the same time, it became my dream. The documentary called The Quest profiles Chip, Lance, the car, and the obstacles leading up to that victory lap. I felt like my dad should have been sitting in that passenger seat, not myself. But at the same time, you know, I was happy to be there. And I know he was in that car with us. And that's where the documentary becomes more than a movie about a car. I really do think it turned out well. And both the filmmaker and his unassuming star realize the movie is really about a family and the lengths a son would go to keep his father's memory alive. In Carlisle, Matt Barcaro, News 8. Tickets for tomorrow night's 7.30 premiere are still available at the Carlisle Theater. All proceeds will go toward research for amyloidosis, the rare disease that, that took Chip Miller's life. Nice story. Uh, coming up next.